Now, why we call it British China is because, first of all, I need to uh, honor my master who have taught my father how to cook it. Hi, uh, good day to you. My name is uh, Frederick. My surname is Pua. They used to call me Uncle Frederick Pua. And I'm actually the founder, the founder of British China. Basically, uh, my flagship is at uh, number 75 Cartmel Road. That is the first one. We started in 2013. Now, why we call it British China is because, first of all, I need to uh, honor my master who have taught my father how to cook it and uh, also uh, because we are Hainanese and British Hainan is something that is that kind of inspired me to use this name and it sounds very catchy during uh, my younger time you know I used to follow my dad uh, because my dad works in a uh, the black and white bungalows, the colonial home, and serving the English master. And I remember my father was actually a cook, and then uh, I was uh, uh, staying in the uh, servants' quarter. So I always vividly remember there is one special dish called uh, oxtail stew. But life is not so easy because when he first started to go in the kitchen, he has to do a lot of other things like, you know, uh, what we call an odd job. He said from there, cleaning up the kitchens and all that. But uh, through his hard work and perseverance, finally he was made to, uh, to learn how to do the preparations. Yeah, and then from cutting and that's it. This is how he start his history uh, being uh, quite a good cook and uh, subsequently uh, very lucky he was called to go on ship yeah and to serve the royal family you know that ferries the royal family yeah so I, I really uh, envy him because uh, he cooked very good food you know especially English uh, dishes that's why um, I think it's uh, in a way in remembrance of him yeah that inspired me that I need to do something about it for the continuity, yeah. We are not using anything, any ingredients that camerize to sweetness. We actually use natural food, like sweet potato. Yeah, well, maybe this is one of the inspiration my father got from the olden days, where we, we, we eat a lot of uh, uh, sweet potato, uh, uh, porridge, yeah. So we, and uh, the other constellation part of it is we collaborate with one uh, long history uh, Hainanese beef noodle. Okay, so we recently won ourselves uh, into Shangri La Hotel. We are very fortunate, and uh, because in all the high end uh, hotel, okay, they I think it's in line with the UNESCO hawker culture. So some of the hotel they will feature the vanishing recipe. So we are very lucky that our Hawaiianese uh, beef noodles is one of our favorite as well. Then recently, because of the COVID, uh, we came up with a very nice curry. We call it the HIBC, the Hainanese inspired British curry, and uh, actually it, it consists of uh, a bit of this. Uh, Braised pork, and then because uh, we are using what you call uh, uh, this, what you call um, turmeric mo, so I thought you know that is one of the latest uh, dish that we offer. Uh, it, it also helps to boost the immune system. So yeah. I just hope that all our customer, apart from the food, please also hope that they like the antique display of our place, the ambiance and we try to provide better service by making them feel at home. Welcome home! <laughs>